Okay, so once we've done the collapsing toolbar code, it's time to work on the floating action button. I have already copied a code from my previous project, I'll paste it in here and explain it in details. So I created a widget that returned a positioned floating action button. I, ga I gave it a top and the right. The top is actually is listening to the scroll controller in here and the edit change once the user scroll in here. We also re returned as a child the transform widget. The transform widget is related to the animation. So once the user scroll, you can see that the floating action button is getting smaller, then it disappears. So let me save this, restart our application. It restarted. It worked. It works so well just as we expected. Now it's time to add some padding for the titles. Let's go to the title widget. And add in here some padding. Let me save it. Yeah, it looks just well, but I prefer to Let's change this value to 14. Yeah, I think it's better now. So that's it for this video. See you in the next video.